Let's put this in perspective for you. Take a look behind me. All of the brown that you see there is dead fish. And Miguel Gonzalez Sr., who walked us up here to show us everything, says he won't even come up here without Vicks and a towel because the smell is just so bad. Usually these waters are together and hasn't been like that for ever since the storm. It's not the waterfront view Miguel Gonzalez Sr. wanted when he moved in last December. Everything you see that is brown, it looks like rocks, that's fish. For the past six days after Hurricane Irma made landfall, neighbors on southwest Dalton Circle have been smelling something, well, fishy. Just a few days ago, Gonzalez well. Sr. stumbled onto this. And despite several calls to South Florida Water Management and the city, the problem is still rotting. I am really, really mad that nobody's taking charge of this yet. They should have taken charge a while back. And it's not just dead fish. Our cameras captured dead turtles. And Gonzalez Sr. says he's even seen alligators. In short, for the viewers at home who, who don't have the privilege of smelling this themselves, can you sort of describe what we're smelling right now? Death. Neighbors say they aren't going to stop calling officials until the C-24 canal is cleaned. This area is so beautiful here and not to have this. In the meantime, Gonzalez Sr. says he refuses to take down his shutters or even open his garage door. Sonica Dongate, WPBF 25 News.